Hey everyone, thanks for joining me today. I'm Rand, a naturalist here at Baltimore Woods Nature Center in Marcellus, New York. And I'm here at the Nature Center today to talk to you about our weekly animal this week, the Cooper's Hawk. Cooper's Hawks were given this name in honor of the ornithologist William Cooper. As we can see here, these hawks have a grayish blue backside a squarish head, and a long tail that ends in a white band, with darker bands above. Their bellies are off-white with dark brown streaking. This one has its feathers fluffed in order to stay warm. These colors help the birds to blend in with their forest habitat, as we see this one doing here. In parts of our region in the eastern U.S., Cooper's hawks live year-round, while in other parts they nest only for the summer. Here in central New York, we are near the edge of these two, so we could potentially see both behaviors. We actually have a pair of Cooper's hawks nesting here at Baltimore Woods. If you keep a close eye out this spring, you may see one of them grabbing small twigs and sticks and flying them up to the treetops to add to their nest. If you're lucky enough to see both at once, try to pick out the larger one. That is the female. Like in most birds of prey, the male is significantly smaller. They could be as small as half the size of the female. Thanks for taking the time to learn about the Cooper's Hawk with me today. If you're interested in learning more about the other plants and animals that call Baltimore Woods home, check out our website at baltimorewoods.org. Thanks again, and we'll see you soon.